Hello and welcome back. My name is Charisma and this is my Osiris gameplay. We are now on episode 20. Okay. Now, as promised, I do have enough on me for the biodome. And I'm going to do that now, if I can, if these are not in the way. Um, I think I would just have to remember which buttons I'm pressing. Uh, so we need the hallway is here and we can confirm that build okay for the hallway we need four iron, iron two aluminium two plastic blah 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 but for the complete build you need nine iron seven aluminium two plastic and seven steel which i will put in the comment section for everybody to um sort of make a note of if you need to now the reason I do that is so when you go up to Azil, you can actually just have a look and see exactly how much you're going to need to do a complete build and take that with you. Uh, and then you're not messing around while you're there, you can build your habitat, you can build your barracks, you can build your biodome uh, straight away. You don't need to sort of mess around and, and sort of gather everything and leave it half half fixed, half done. So you'll know exactly what you need, exactly what resources you need, exactly what resources you need to take with you to complete that. Now you could just sort of like think, right, well, I'll just take the habitat and the airlock up to start with. Do that. Then that, you know, you, you've got... It's all there. It's in the um, comment section of each of the builds that I've done. I've sort of uh, gone back and, and uh, put that down for you. I've, I've written it down, made a note of it all for you so you can just take that with you when you go up to Azil or you know when they open up the other planets and things you'll know exactly what to take with you for each building you need so yeah it'll just make it a little bit easier um, it also reminds me of what I need as well when I go up there so whoops, no, come on don't wibble and wobble like that please thank you okay and the biodome is quite easy. It's just exactly what you need in the structures bit. That is all you need. You don't need to do any other walls and things like that. You do need the uh, planters, the smart bins. But obviously, again, that's, that's already sort of here for you, exactly what you'll need each time. So we can do the smart bins don't know if we know yes we do know the other smart bins as well but we need wire for those and iron ore and batteries and the circuit boards we do actually have those so we could use the smart bins hmm. but we're also going to need the excrement collector because we do need to do the soil as well so that's something else we're going to have to do which we can do we can put that up and around here sort of thing out of the way sort of here we could do that and that's absolutely fine but that is the i'll take you in if we can get in can we get in please thank you thanks so there we go that is the biodome done that's the biodome done and we put it here um I, I do normally put it on the back there but we put it here because then we can see practically all the way around which i like that i like where it is here we can see where the lab is, we can see what's coming from there. Uh, we've got a good view from here. Yeah, so I actually like this, I like where this is. Okay, so we can do with some wire, actually. I don't know, what we have two. We have two. This is not very many, is it? It's not very many. And we need four. For each one. Four. So we can go in, no, not like that, thank you. We can go in here and see what we need for the wire, which is rubber, copper and gold. And we have all that outside, so we can go and make some of that. And copper, gold, and rubber we have on us. And we have some rubber in there as well. That's okay. Open, please. Thank you. 
and we'll make so that's four I'm just gonna make one for the moment oops come on come on come along and batteries batteries that is exactly what we needed oops we're missing something come on the iron I should have bloody known Hello, iron. Yeah, we're going to need to collect some more iron anyway, but we have some up there, so that's fine. I'm just going to build one at the moment. Because, well, we can. But we might as well. We might as well. We can't do the soil just yet, so... We don't really need to build all of them, but we can build this one now. Just so you can see. <coughs> For those that haven't seen it before previously there we go and then you fill with the soil so you'll just press each one like G for bin 2 F for bin 1 C for 1 bin 3 which is self-explanatory really but we require soil to plant so we're going to need to do the excrement collector so that is something we need to build and that is this way I believe and there it is and we can build one so we're going to go do that as well see it helps to um, hoard <laughs> things sometimes I know I'm always sort of collecting things I'm terrible for it so let's turn that round my way, I really don't want it there. Stop. Can I not? Well, I've got to build it there now. Because I can't get off of it. Hold action button to no longer... I don't want to. I'm going to build it there. Because I can't move it now anyway. You need to be able to cancel that off. The build thing. Please. Once it's there. That's okay. It's fine. So 29 minutes and 54 seconds. So half an hour each time you want to empty your suit. It's fine there. It's fine. It's fine there. Yeah, it's fine. Let's not worry. Absolutely fine. But yeah, that's uh, that's the hallway in the dome done now, which is awesome along with the smart bin but that's cool so, yay nice nicely done I think that looks quite cool right? I can't show you um, from the top actually until it's light but you'll be able to see from up here what it looks like But oh that looks quite cool right? doesn't it I like that it's a shame you can't add more habitats on top and things like that, you know, like to the other side for extra storage and things. That would be cool. We'll be able to sort of do a couple of uh, barracks and all that type of thing. We need to be able to put storage in the barracks as well. You know, maybe even the little crates, just the little crates in there. That would be uh, helpful. Because coming out to the storage all the time can be a little bit... Um, irritating so yeah um, I'm gonna be going to have a look to get some uh, diamond as well very soon but I think we are gonna go back and do um, mine 1b and have a quick look through there see if we can grab a little bit of diamond but uh, I have had a tip on the comment section um, where near mine 1a there's a precious metal sort of field that we can go and try and just sort of like we'll just keep bashing away at some precious metal and see whether or not we get lucky with that um yeah so that's something we could try which is really good so i just want to get some diamond i want to be able to start building some vehicles now and uh, even building the spaceship yeah <coughs> because in the last season we just built the spaceship we were ready to go to azeal and uh, unfortunately 
Um, well, I say unfortunately, the update dropped and obviously we had to start again, which is fair enough, you know, it's just one of those things, I, it, it's early access, it happens. Um, so we started again and, and obviously we've had a really good look at uh, this uh, new update and I think, you know, around about half an hour per episode and, you know, we're on, what, episode 20 now? isn't too bad I mean I've got to this stage you know where I, I'm able to sort of like build the whole building and I've got resources and things like that and I have actually learned quite a bit um, so it's not too bad it doesn't take too long if you work it out that way and obviously in the videos I'm not sort of constantly grinding for uh, certain things and, and things like that I have done a little bit of grinding of off screen as well um, and I've not recorded that so but if you play all the way through you know it's not going to take that long really to sort of get up and running um, it is difficult to start with you know it is a little bit daunting to start with because you're bashing rocks with a rock uh, and things like that unless you start with the pick um, yeah so it can be a little bit daunting but you know, I still really thoroughly enjoy the game. I, I enjoy having to sort of um, run around and, you know, fight the aliens and sort of grab everything I need to grab. <laughs> you know, I do enjoy that. I enjoy the gathering. I enjoy the exploring. You know, and I enjoy the survival aspect of the game. So I'm quite happy to um, continue playing and seeing what they come up with. Um, I do want to get the spaceship done again. Uh, I do want to be able to get up to a zeal um, because like I say in the last season we weren't able to we did get the spaceship done and I was getting prepared to sort of go to a zeal um, to be able to you know build the habitat and everything up there but uh, like I say my, my little plans were um, were sort of changed because of the uh, update which is fine <laughs> absolutely fine um, do we have another pick? Yes, we do. We could probably do with putting this away, actually. So, let's put this away before we head off up to my 1B. Um, we'll just pop it in here, actually. Because, you know, why not? Yeah, we'll just do that. That's fine. We'll just leave that there. That's absolutely cool. Right, so we can grab some things um, later. We can grab some things from around there and, and make some more blades and, and things like that. That's absolutely fine. I mean, we can do a lot of that sort of while we're out and about anyway. Um, we don't necessarily need to be here to do any of that. We can um, make a lot of the things that we need on the outdoor oven and workbench, the primitive oven and workbench. We can make a lot of things on there. We can also make the masking tape on the go with the berries and the banana skins. So <coughs> it is doable. All of it's doable. It's um, one of those things. Hi. Hi. Don't charge, please. I do tell people that you're not supposed to charge. And I just hurt myself. I've hurt myself trying to get away from you. You're really horrible. No, you don't. Go away. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Where have you gone? Come here. No, you're not charging at me again. We're trying to go to mine 1B. Stop it. Where have you gone? Come here. No, you're not charging. Oh, you just charged me then, you little bugger. Oh, you're dead. <laughs> Thank you. You can go now. Bye-bye. I did turn around to actually have a little look at the base then from this angle from up here and obviously spotted him but look at that that looks cool looks so cool awesome love it I didn't bring a battery with me just in case the battery runs out oh my never mind I was just going to wait for the others as well because we're going to probably end up with some more sort of at us yeah, that's going to be a thing. Never mind. I do hope we get some batteries from in here. 
I could run back and actually grab one. But never mind. We might find a uh, satellite on the way as well. So that would be good. That might give us batteries. See, I try not to sort of uh, worry too much about sort of everything that I take out with me and things. So, because I know that anything that I need while I'm out, I don't need to sort of weigh myself down with that. I can just take it with me. No, I can get it while I'm out, sorry. I don't need to take it all with me. <clears throat> as long as you've got a glass um, container on you, you can get sap, you can drink sap, you know, it's no big deal. As long as you've got food on you or, you know, you, wherever you're going, you've got the oven, you can prepare food. So you don't really, really need to um, sort of encumber yourself before you even set off. So, because there's everything you need out on the planet, you know. So that's why I don't worry so much about it. I do have enough berries on me if I want to make some more uh, makeshift bandages and things like that. So I'm happy enough. I'm happy enough. Um, yeah, I think I'm going in the right direction. For the mine yes Oop, that's really that way whoopsie oh I don't like it when it storms go away storm stormy weather maybe we don't want the storms thank you yeah this is where we can't see a bloody thing my battery will go soon as well. Oh, adult skeleton. Hi. I really don't want to mess around with you, Hank. Hopefully you'll bugger off. You leave me alone. Leave me be. Leave me be. Why? Oh, come on, get up the bloody side, silly. Silly thing. Silly woman. Yeah, so we're going to just go down to Mine Boulder, have a little look around. And then we will go to have a look at the... Uh, if we no luck, we'll go and have a look at the area that has been put in the comment section. I will show you that. And you can see where that is. It's always good. I mean, it's always good to have that kind of information. So, you know. So what's put in the comment section helps me and helps you also. Which is great you know oopsie daisy come on get up get up come on keep going wow you really are not very agile are you up and over no get over the bloody thing you can get over there see see told you told you you could do it. There we go. Here we go. The battery's not, not lasting very much. <laughs> oh well. Oh dear. Never mind. We'll be fine. We'll be absolutely fine. Yeah, the uh, big wormy thing is coming. Hello, I don't know where about you're coming from. There you are. Oh wow, you're pretty damn close. Don't know if you could see that. I don't know if you could see that, but uh, it was a bit close. I'm glad I still had some hover fuel left. But the battery's running out. That is running out. We need to find one in my boulder. I'm hoping we do. If not, it's going to be a little bit dark in there for you guys. And I'm sorry. But as soon as I get a battery in there, I will change it and I will put the battery, on, the battery in and the lights on for you. <laughs> uh, there's normally a rack. I don't think it's a gnat, I think it's the arachnoid, the one that spits at you. 
Where's it gone? Hello. I might. Oh, it's an infant gnat as well. I don't think I've left any batteries actually here. I could have left some batteries here actually. That would be good. I know that sometimes I do leave batteries everywhere. And I did build a forged plutonium reactor here as well. I don't know whether I showed you that. Let's see if we left some batteries here. Did we leave batteries? No, we didn't. Bugger. Oh, bugger. Never mind. Right, guys. Well, we're here anyway. So, I can just save that, that bit there. So, yeah, we're here. We're here. And there's a blue blueberry tree there so we can go and grab some blueberries because we did have uh, we did do the red berries but we could do with some more science points as well uh, but we are going to go back into mine boulder um, probably not going to do that right now um, because it is sort of night time and nearly end of the video anyway um, so yeah that it's going to be a thing we're going to go in and we're going to sort of have a little look around see whether or not we can find any diamond in there hopefully we can if not, I know we're going to stock up on bullets, so that's the thing as well. You know, we're going to need those for when we make the guns. I could have probably made the guns now, but uh, yeah, I'm not too bothered. I, I don't mind the melee, so that's okay. <laughs> I, I don't mind the melee at all. All right, guys. Well, thank you very much for watching. Uh, I know it's been a, a little bit, uh, a little bit sort of me just walking along to get back here, but. Uh, you know, it has to be done. I want to get set up for the next video and make sure that we go straight into my boulder. And we did do the biodome. Sorry if you can hear my son in the background. He's playing on his computer, so <laughs> he is very loud, actually. Um, but yeah, thank you very much for watching. I will put in the comments section uh, what you need for the barrack. Uh, sorry, not the barracks, the biodome and the hallway. Um, yeah, and let you know. Just sort of put it there so you've got it for future reference. Okay, guys, thank you very much for watching. Hopefully I will see you in the next episode. Until then, bye for now.